my name's Dinah. I have a PhD in biochemistry and molecular biology, and I'm also the lead singer of the all-female ACDC tribute band, Thunderstruck. I am Stephanie Lee, and I'm a stay-at-home mom. My name is Kane, my mom <laughs> Being in a tribute allows a lot of different things. You get to obviously play and have fun, but you also get to pay tribute to a band that you really love. We actually met, uh, you know, a lot of ACDC. We went to their concert, so uh, backstage we met them. Also, uh, Dinah has sat in with Brian. A lot of the tribute bands are like older music that, that people really love, and I think people just want to hear what they know. We're kind of tough chicks, though, too, so if you do something, we'll punch you. <laughs> So Thunderstruck has gone to Iraq five times. Tell us about that. Uh, well, those are, the, those are our favorite tours. I uh, love doing the military tours. We've done Iraq, we've done Afghanistan a couple of times. We've had Chris Slade sit in with us, who used to be the drummer. He's actually uh, sat in with us a number of times and even went on a tour with us to Afghanistan. He's an awesome, amazing drummer. I have nothing but good things to say about him. How do the hardcore male fans treat you after a show? It's different before and after. <laughs> before they're kind of like, let's check this out with their arms crossed and afterwards they're usually, wow, they can actually play and they come up and they're like, great job and didn't really think so, you know. They become pretty big fans afterwards. We are one of the only Southern California bands in general that are the same five members almost 10 years now. Well, Thunderstruck is obviously very, very unique because it's all females um, playing ACDC, you know, sort of almost the quintessential guy band. But you know what? Those girls rock and they rock hard. Well, my band definitely has referred to me as the crazy one in the past and, uh, you know, my reputation can precede me on that. There you go, little man. But, uh, you know, being a mom kind of settles you down at least during certain times. <laughs> but then there's Karen. So she decides to stage dive. She goes, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. When you stage dive and you that jump out good. and you're on your back and they pass you around and then you go up and you rock it. <laughs> Karen dives <laughs> chest first right into the crowd and she's flying. And what do you do with that? You're like, oh wait, no, oh, oh, oh. And the band is just rolling because, you know, Karen, she's like, what? We're all punk in here, we're punk rockers, let's dive. And it's like, honey, you're supposed to roll when you dive. Pass it along. <laughs> Dinah is, is just a phenomenal singer. She's just a great front person. Her, she has a voice, I don't know how she sings this stuff. I get a sore throat just listening to her sing it. But uh, it's amazing, she's, she's this total normal, scientific person by day and then becomes this rock star by night. She's a, she's a trip, very interesting person. My significant other is Kelly Hansen from the band Foreigner. And so he's a musician, lead singer as, a, as well. And so we have a house of two lead singers, which is always kind of funny. Did he ever give me any advice? Oh, he gives me singing tips all the time because he's an awesome singer and so like how to take care of your voice, what to do. And he's the best at that. I mean, it's really hard when people sing intense to be able to keep that kind of stuff up and do, you know, be on tour without losing your voice. Balls, they'd be bigger than yours. Self-explanatory. Yeah, especially, wait till you see us play. <laughs> <laughs>